good morning students my name is dilip parmato and i am your class teacher math teacher and also the class teacher of class 2 okay today we will read the chapter 1 as you can see here the chapter 1 name is the division numbers up to 99 as we know that numbers up to 99 that means we will read the numbers of second digit two digits number we will read the numbers of two digit number okay so let's start the class for today so was the kavi here i am writing the chapter 1 numbers beyond to 99 okay the first number is when we read the two digit number how can we write the number in words okay how can you write the number in words at first i am taking the example 64 as you can see here 64 the simplest form when we write the number in words 64 can be written as also 60 plus 4 as you can see here 60 plus 4 okay and then 60 is written as 60 and 4 written as 4 okay i am taking a next example to better understand i am taking a next example 74 where 74 is written as 70 plus 4 then 70 is here 70 and 4 is here 4 okay this was this was the example of that how can we write the number in words how can you write the number in words now i am taking the third example where i am saying that how can we write the words in number how can you write the words in number so you can see here that we have taken the words 38 38 as you can 30 can be written as 3030 and 8 can be written as 8 now we will add this number so i give the symbol between them add this number then 30 plus 8 is 38 okay here we read that how can we how can we write the number in words and how can we write the words in number so when we write the number in words we will have to do the expanded form or in the simplest form then we write the number in words that will that will be the easily and when we write the words in number that will be also the easy if you will write the values of the words okay now as you can see here the text topic next topic is expanded form and short form what are the expanded form and short form before this we will say that what are the values of a number or what are the place values of a number because in expanded form we will use the place values so read this so look here i am taking some examples 8 13 108 5132 okay as you can look the example here the as you know that this is the ones place this is ones place this is tens place this is ones this is tens this is hundred this is ones this is tens this is hundred this is thousand as you know everyone that these are the places of a digit okay now as you know that these are the places so how can we write the place values place values of a number look here 534 here is a given a number 534 where the 3 is a tens 4 is ones and 5 is 4 is ones and 5 is on 100 place 5 is on 100 place okay now you can see here i am taking two numbers 18 i am taking two numbers 18 now i want to write the place value of 18 or i want to write the place value of 10 so when we write the place value of 10 as you can see here just i am giving a now look the place value if i take the example place value i am taking a number 38 okay now i want to write the place values of Three. I have the values, place values of three. Then what will I do? That if I want to ask the place values of three, then I will write here three directly. Then I will look here in the question that after the three, up there is a three. After the three, how many digits are? Only one. So I will give a one zero. You can find out the place value of three like this. Okay. If I take a second example, four seven six, four seven six. i want to know the place value of 4 i 
I want to know the place value of 4 then what will you do as you know that I want to ask the place value of 4 so we write here 4 then after here you can see the number after the 4 there are 2 digits 1 2 digits so there will be 2 0 ok this way I, we can write the place values now we will read the expanded form we can read the expanded form as you can see here the expanded form topic time is I am for this I am giving an example as you can just understand it better that if I will ask you that what is the expanded form of 437 437 then as you can say that if I want to write the expanded form of 437 then we will have to we will have to write the place values of each number place value of each number that means here is 4 so we can write the 4 and after that 4 how many digits are 2 digits they will write 2 0 after then plus we will give the plus then after the 4 there are 3 so we write the place values of 3 there is 3 then I will write here 3 after the 3 only 1 digits are here so I will give 1 0 then after the 3 only 7 digits so we will give 7 and after the 7 there is no 0 there is no digits so I will not give the 0 here ok in this way we can write the expanded form now how can we write the short form how can we write the short form if I am giving example 500 plus 30 plus 6 500 plus 30 plus 6 this is the form of standard form we will write the short form short form that means we will collect we will collect the numbers of every digits we will collect the numbers of every digit and we will write together we will write together that means as you know that here is one digit here is two digit here is three digit so the ones place will be ones place six here the sec the one plus ones place is zero tens place is three so we we'll write here three tens place and then after ones tens is zero third place is five so we we'll write here hundred place okay in this way this is the short form this is the short form as it is as we as this we can write the expanded form we can write the expanded form and from the expanded form we can write the short form okay now we will read the next topic the topic name is before after and in between that means what will be the before number what will be the after number and what will be the between the number so to understand it look it in the copy as you can see here I mean, I'm giving the first heading middle number okay I am giving the first heading middle number as you can say that middle number that means between middle number that means between I am giving here 56 a box and 58 then we will write the what will be the number between 56 and 58 so as you know that we will remember always that in between after before we will write we will know that we will compare the digit from the right side of the number here is the right side number is 6 here is the right side number is 8 okay the left side number will be always same the left side of the number will be always same okay or if different then i will say you that here is 6 here is 8 then as you can know as you can know here that there is 6 7 and 8 then what is the numbers between between 6 and 8 is 7 so we will write here 7 and the number was 5 so we will write the 5 then it will be the 57 okay now next the next digit is a number i give a number 73 75 as you know that the left place are same so we will compare the right side 3 and 5 as you know that here is 3 here is 5 so between 3 and 5 4 is therefore i write the here 4 and the number will be 7 okay in this way we can write the middle number now we can write the previous number how can you write the previous number then as you can see here that here are three examples which I have given here I take the a box before the box, previous number that means before I write before a box and then I give a number 56 then what will be the number before 56 so as you can see here we will compare the right side number 6 as you as you know this is the count this is the counting before 6 the number 5 has come before 6 number has 5 so we will write here 5 and 5 will be 5 ok now what will be the number before 40 what will be the number before 40 so as you can see here here is a 0 because the right digits are 0 so as you know there is 0 
before 0 there is 9 so the digits will be 9 then if there is one condition that if here will be 0 and we will write the previous number that means the tens place 4 will be mi minus 1 that means here will be 3 if we are writing the previous number we will if we are writing the previous number and the ones place is 0 then we will write here 9 and the tens place will be minus 1 that will be 3 okay the next digit is in the box and 97 as you can see here the right place is 7 so what is the number comes after the before the 7 7 before is comes 6 so we will write here 6 and the number will be same okay now the after the number after the number as you know that the number is 38 then after I give a box because the number will come after the 38 so as you know the right place is 8 so after the 8 9 comes so I will give you after the 8 9 comes and 3 is 3 now the 40 40 that means when a 0 is here as you know that after the 0 after the 0 is nine, nothing come that means you will say the counting will be devised that means after the 0 1 will come again the counting will start okay so after the 0 there will be 1 but there is no any condition in this year because this is the number of after so the 4 will be 4 okay now the 56 56 as you know that after the 6 7 comes so I will write here 7 and the one number 5 will be remain same now 69 as we know that this is the after this is the after the number so as you know that after the 9 there is 0 comes after the 9 there is 0 comes so we write here 0 and and since the 6 tens place is 6 that will be the right place so here the tens place will be 7 here because only the one condition in before that if a one's place is 0 then we will subtract 1 in tens place and in a one there is a one condition after the number that if a one's place is 9 then we will add plus 1 in tens place okay now the next topic will be on continue on the next class thank you